Welcome back to the full stack development with Angular and Spring MVC. My name is Bhushan. In the previous video, we have created a service interface and the service implementation class. In this video, we will create a controller class and let's call the service method. Inside the controller package, let's create a class. I'm going to call this book controller. I'm going to annotate this class with a at rest controller because we are creating a rest API. Inside this, I'm going to create a service object, private book service. I'm going to call this book service. I'm not going to create an object for this book service. I'll tell spring container to create an object for us. I'm going to annotate this with the auto wire. Let me write a comments, get all the books public response entity I'm gonna call this list let me import the list which is from java.util package and the book which is from spring.model inside this I'm going to call a service method book service dot list I'm going to call this list return response entity dot ok dot body to this body we will pass the list of books if you are working in a real time applications the response entity should not be our return type we will create our custom class and we will add our custom properties like response code, response message and the response object. But for now, let's keep it simple. Let's use response entity as our return type. I'm going to annotate this method with the at get mapping because this is a HTTP get request, get mapping and the mapping would be slash API slash book. All right, we have written a method for get list of books now it's time to test our application before that we need to add a few records to our database in interest of time i have already three records to our database or to our table now let's execute the command which is select star from book you can see the records that are there in the table in order to test our api we need a rest client i have already downloaded the postman if you don't have postman then go to google and search for postman rest client and you can see the first link which is from chrome web store click on this and download the postman i have already downloaded so it is showing as a launch app so i launch the postman and here we will test our api so before that i'm going to run the project right click choose run as run on server it is asking me to save the book controller file save this click next Click finish. This will open in a browser. So copy the URL and go to postman and paste that URL. In this case, API slash books or book. Let me minimize and let me verify this. All right, it's API slash book. Copy this and I'll paste it. It's a get request so click on the send you can see all the records which are there in the database three mistakes of my life two states i too had a love story let's verify in the database three mistakes of my life two states i too had a love story in the console you can see that the sql query is executing so finally our application is up and running so in the next video we're going to write rest of the methods and we will complete this api that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video.